Kind of the process is that we have, um, this is a blue screen here. We um, bring Nassim in or the characters in, and then the blue actually disappears like the um, weatherman uh, showing the weather maps. And so then right, what we're doing right now is we're, we've, we're building these beautiful gardens and Zen temples and bridges and stuff in a, in a 3D modeling package. And then we're gonna bring the characters in. And then as the player, they'll be able to go in, into that and into that virtual world. And as they progress through the game, as they learn more and as they do different exercises and meditation techniques, then actually the world expands to them. They're offered new places to go in the garden. They're offered, um, you know, more challenges there. And then when they get to a certain point, they actually get to go talk to the Zen master and get a new robe. So there's this level to it. So it has a lot of the gaming um, things that you would see in modern games, but I would almost, I just really, I don't know if I'd even call it a game. It's a journey, it's an experience. I believe it's a, it will be a life-changing experience. I think it will be something that um, people will, will walk away from and then have to come back because it will be continually expanding. It will be uh, an experience that they, I just think it will be a, a life-changing experience because even here on, as the crew, being here for four days, and learning about this, um, what Nassim has to offer, has been really, um, really a great experience.